think we've gone too far. Far from the diversity of nature, which is what spells survival. We're, we're just completely sort of cement-like and monstrous. The nomadic strategy has been extincted by our speed and our True. stupidity. And when you talk about nomads, you talk about an endangered species that barely exists. It's like a rhino. It might as well be in a zoo. And regardless of any of the information that's been handed down, for some reason, it's not infiltrating. Why do you think that well, is? Politicians are leading the world. Politicians need votes. Politicians have to love people. Politicians work for people. Politicians lie to people. Politicians are liars. Mm -hmm. Is there anyone in this world that you have any kind of you know, sensitivity to what they're doing, what they're trying for? Whatever. I like Dalai Lama. He's looking good. He's looking good. <laughs> I think so, yeah. Compassion's all we have left against our Does understanding. He... You have to try and understand why this disease is so unstoppable. You mean the human condition disease? The human horror. The horror, the horror. I mean, how do we describe ourselves? We always describe ourselves in these great terms. What you're saying... Egotistical, selfish, greedy, megalomaniac. Human locust. Feeding until the end. Exactly. Maggots scratching and killing each other for that last little morsel, molecule of flesh. Getting those bones all white and slimy. God. What is that kind of animal that eats itself? What is that? Well, they say hyenas do, but... <laughs> this is worse than a hyena. Is there anything... <laughs> <laughs> well, it's a, it's a phenomenon. Phantasmagoria. The thing about the nomadic strategy is yeah. that whenever aid money, whenever help from the outside world comes in, mm -hmm. they dig boreholes, they put water in, they put permanent settlement financing. That is a death blow. The Bushmen, Somalis, Turkana, Maasai, they've all been eradicated by this policy of what's called aid. Do-gooders aid the lords of poverty. Do-gooders are doing bad. Aid is not working. Aid is a long-term weapon. We are a deadly enemy. Our help is pulling the rug out from under those who are theoretically trying to help. God knows. It's hard to believe we even think it's helping because the record is so clear. If you read the alms race, the history of American voluntary aid abroad, or the Lords of Poverty, mm -hmm. the power, the prestige, and the corruption of the international aid industry. You can immediately find out what a death blow these helping hands are. As righteous as their intentions are, mm -hmm. they come from the guilt-ridden, spoiled world that has basically ripped off its resources and is misapplying the abundant guilt with benevolence that destroys the infrastructure and the people related to it. We I mean, you're talking aid doesn't work. It, what does work? I say aid has not worked. Has not worked. Not in the way in which it's being delivered. The only thing I can see right now is birth control. Birth control, war, guns, or wild and uncontrollable diseases, viruses, plagues.